installation and debugging of ZYC series ultrasonic vibrating screen. 1. The adherence of ultrasonic mesh cloth. 1. Put the mesh installation ring on the working table. Spread the mesh cloth on and get it fixed with hooks. Press it into circular groove and tighten the screws. Two, put net rack on the working table. Place the mesh installation ring with the mesh side down on the net rack. Put net rack into the ring. Three, fix the net rack to the installation ring with six customized clips. Grab from the inside of the outside ring of net rack. Make the screws tightened. Four, adhere the mesh to the net rack with the fluid solution. After it becomes solid, loose the screws and take off the clips and installation rings. Cut down the surplus mesh. Two, the installation of a bottom frame. One, fix small V-shaped sitting ring to the bottom of the bottom frame. Then put it on the vibrating body and make all around even. 2. Fix the small clamp ring to the vibrating body and the bottom frame. Hit around the clamping ring while tightening the nut to the clamp until it is tightened. 3. Installation of nut rack and upper frame. 1. Put the nut rack with mesh on the working table. Fix the small U-shaped seating ring on. Install ultrasonic transducer on the space. Then tighten it up with a wrench. Two. Put the net rack on the bottom frame. Put the outlet of the transducer into the outlet hole of the bottom frame. Then tighten up the screw with a rubber gasket in the middle. 3. Fix the upper frame to ultrasonic net rack. Make a bottom frame, net rack and the upper frame aligned around. Hit around the small clamp ring while tightening the nut to the clamp until it is tightened enough. 4. The installation of dust cover. 1. Fix the small V-shaped seating ring to the dust cover. Place it on the upside of the upper frame. 2. Install the small clamp ring. Hit around the clamp ring while tightening the nut to the clamp until it is tightened enough. 5. Debugging 1. Turn on the ultrasonic power source to check if the power source and the screen mesh function normally. Then, turn on the power source of the CV machine. 2. Press the sweep frequency button to start automatic scanning. If it doesn't work, press next frequency key until normal scanning. 3. Remove the base cover plate. Loosen the cruise on the under eccentric block of the motor. Hold the upper eccentric block with one hand through the access door of the vibrating body. Turn the under eccentric block to correct angle with the other hand. Then tighten the screws of the under eccentric block. Put the cover plate back. 4. According to the features of the materials, Adjust the angle of upper and the lower heavy hammer, 15 to 90 degrees. The bigger the angle is, the more likely the material is covered toward the center. The smaller the angle is, the faster the materials disperse outwards.